And it's 614 now on this Friday morning. How about a live look outside towards the shipping canal? It's just a gorgeous sunrise brewing out there over Lake Superior. You can also see the winds are whipping. The waves are definitely kind of churning out there on Lake Superior as well. Winds out of the east off of Lake Superior. Well, that's going to keep us cooler by the lake through the daytime hours today, as well as basically the entirety of this weekend. Right now on top of the hill, we're at 42 degrees on top of the hill at Duluth International. Winds out of the north and east between 10 and 15 miles per hour. At times, we're seeing wind gusts upwards of 30 to 35 miles per hour. Temperatures across the region, we got 39 right now. Ironwood, 41 bars meet for the upper peninsula of Michigan. 38 right now, Ashland, 37 Solon Springs, 38 Superior. 41 Two Harbors, 41 Grand Marais. 37 Ely, 40 Hibbing, 41 Orr, 41 right now International Falls as well, and got 42 right now Grand Rapids. Most of us looking at a mixture of sun and clouds overhead. There is the opportunity for a few stray rain showers here through the morning hours today, as well as basically through the entirety of the day today. But if you do see any showers, they'll be short-lived, and they really will not produce all that much precipitation. You can see that here on Futurecast again, the opportunity for a few stray showers here and there. I think for the most part, we'll start off our day with the more, su more sunshine than increasing clouds as we head towards this afternoon as well as this evening. By about 4 o'clock this evening, you can see some rain across northwest Wisconsin. That rain will stick around through the overnight hours tonight and as we head towards tomorrow morning. Starting off our day tomorrow, We'll all be talking about those clouds, primarily rain for northwest Wisconsin to start off our day tomorrow morning. Then that will expand northward here as we head through the daytime hours tomorrow, beginning to arrive on the Minnesota side of things as we head towards tomorrow afternoon as well as tomorrow evening. Now, in terms of your forecast for today on Sunday, yes, it's another cloudy day to start. Again, the opportunity for a few stray showers here and there. But then as we head towards Sunday evening, I think there is the opportunity to see even a little bit of sunshine, especially from the Twin Ports Point south across the southern half of the region. Now, in terms of rainfall for today, today, we're seeing very little of it. May as well say some places could see maybe one or two hundredths of an inch of rain. Then as we head towards tomorrow, that's really when we begin to tack on to those rain tolls. On the Minnesota side of things, you might as well say most places running anywhere between a quarter and up to half an inch of rain. Northwest Wisconsin, the Upper Peninsula, they could see some higher totals down there between half an inch and possibly up to an inch of new rain as we head through the course of this weekend. Now, as I mentioned, the other thing we are talking about is that lake breeze. Today, we're talking about temperatures 40s lakeside, 50s and 60s the further inland you go. For our day tomorrow, again, another day where we're cool by the lake, 40s by the Lake Superior shorelines. Then you get to see the 50s and some lower 60s the further inland you go for both Minnesota as well as northwest Wisconsin. Check out for the day on Sunday. Some could make a run towards the 70 degree mark off to our south, but meanwhile around Lake Superior, we're going to still be stuck in the low to mid 40s. So, yep, that pesky lake breeze is going to stick around here for the next few days. And we have that same lake breeze for today. Today, you can see the Twin Ports, the North Shore, as well as the South Shore. We're going to be stuck in the 40s, but the Iron Range, Northwest Wisconsin, inland portions of the area, they're going to make their way into the 50s and 60s. And now look at that seven day forecast. You can see the lake breeze sticks around for the weekend. The opportunity for a few rain showers for this weekend as well. I think the wetter of the two days is probably Saturday. Sunday, maybe the opportunity for a few stray showers here and there. A few pesky showers stick around for the start of next week as well. But then temperatures return back into the 60s as we head towards next Wednesday. Wednesday, excuse me, partly cloudy skies overhead. So 